is Kentucky School of Art at Spalding University, and today we have an art opening in our gallery in conjunction with the art opening at the Huff Gallery at Spalding. In our gallery, we have Gwendolyn Kelly, and there are three artists opening in the Huff Gallery, and they are fiber artists. So in, in the efforts to make this an event, with other activities going on, we thought, what project can we do outside that would be fiber-oriented to go with that art opening, and we decided to do a knit bombing event. What is knit bombing? <laughs> <laughs> we have 23 very plain white poles here, and oh, we have new knitters sitting in here. <laughs> I just saw that. Great. Welcome. Thank you for coming. Right. Great. That's great. So we put it out to the community. We used Facebook, website, all kinds of, went to the Louisville, um, Louisville area fiber artists and, and some more groups to find knitters, crocheters, uh, creative types who wanted to come decorate the poles with knitted materials. Um, they call it uh, knit bombing, they call it graffiti, they call it, call it installation. We've never done it before. None has of us anyone have. in the country done it before? Yes, it, it has been in other cities. I've, you can see it on the, on, a, on the web under knit bombing or yarn bombing. Okay. People go to public spaces, they get stop signs, parking meters, and they cover them up with yarn. And so we thought, well, this is a good temporary installation to make this look much more artistic and get the community involved. We like to do events here where you get, get the community. And it's a nice harbinger to spring, too, with That's all right. the bright colors. Perfect day. Perfect yeah. day. So. All right. Thanks very much, Casey. Yeah.